What is up everybody? Welcome back to the channel. BW Card Collector here back with another video for you. And today we are doing I believe this is mystery box number six. Um these boxes, uh, you know, the last box was it was okay. Um it's probably if I had to rate the last box out of the all five, I'd probably say it was probably the worst box we opened. We did get an autograph out of that box. Um somebody I've never heard of. But uh, I would say pack selection wise, it was probably the worst. Hopefully this one isn't the identical pack selection, but we shall see. Um, I have still yet to find a graded card in any of these boxes, but they apparently are out there. Um, there's also, I have found uh, 2019 Chrome. I found series uh, 2019 series two. I have found 2018 series two. Um, the last box had 2018 uh, holiday, uh, Walmart exclusive holiday. It had, uh, I believe, uh, two 18 series one packs. One was a hobby and the other one was a retail. And then it had a 19 series one. Um, and it had a 18 sticker collection. And then a Babe Ruth collection pack as well, which I'm sure there'll be one of those in here either that or a triple play i have seen those in other boxes that were opened um if there's a sticker collection in here or a triple play or a babe ruth collection i i don't open those i usually give those away to nieces nephews things like that um, but let's get into this and see what we can find hopefully we'll, hopefully we'll get lucky and pull one of those uh, uh graded cards that'd be awesome Pull a Jordan Alvarez or Pete Alonzo. This Pete Alonzo top chrome or tops chrome 19 graded. Looks like it's a Beckett or the autographs a 10 and the uh, card itself is a 9.5. That'd be cool. There's a Vladdy Jr. Bowman first um, 9.5. Cody Bellinger 9.5. Jordan Alvarez first Bowman. So yeah, let's see what we get in here. No, nope, doesn't look like there's going to be a uh, graded card in there, but there is a trusty sticker collection. Like I said, I won't open that. I will stick it over here with the other couple packs of that I have, um, and I will give that away to some kids. Okay, let's pull the rest of this out. So we got another Series 1 Hobby from 18. That's cool. There's a 19 Holiday. That's cool. That's a cool pack. Um, I actually have this entire set, and I have I did pull a, um, a super short print Acuna out, which is actually right here, um, with the stars on the eye black there, um, so that was really cool. Hopefully we'll find something like that, that'd be awesome. Um, we'll leave that pack back there, that's our hit or not the pack sorry the card that's our hit card and we got a babe ruth collection so we'll just stack that babe ruth collection on top of that uh special card um we, so again we have the 19 holiday we have a, another 2018 series one this is a um oh just a retail pack so we got a, a hobby pack and a retail 19 series one upper deck x and 19 holiday so hmm, not the greatest lineup but not the worst either um, again i think the last box was probably a little worse than this uh the 18 holiday i guess there was a, the chance of the otani um autograph or not autograph but otani rookie and the uh Oh, the Acuna rookie, maybe the Glaber Torres rookie, but I did not find any of those. Uh, Luis Castillo starting us off. There's a Tim Anderson, Trey Turner, Andrew Heaney, Miguel Sano, Enrique Hernandez. There's an All Smiles, Pujols, and uh, holds bets at first. Colin Moran, Lorenzo Cain, and Mike Zunino. Yeah, let's do 2008 Upper Deck X. This is actually a pretty cool product. Um, I, 
this is right at the tail end of when I stopped collecting. Um, before, of course, before I picked it up. I, I didn't pick collecting back up real heavy again until, oh, it was probably, I'd say mid-2019. So, you know, I didn't, only about a year, maybe a year and a half ago at most, did I start collecting real heavy again. I took about a 10 to 12 year break. Um, Alex Rios. Jonathan Papelbon. Oh, there's a nice Ichiro um, foil exponential card. I'm a diehard Ichiro fan. So that is awesome. I will sleeve and top load that right now. I don't know that that's numbered. I mean, they didn't really do a whole lot of numbering on cards back in the 2008 era. A few cards here and there were numbered, but not a ton. That's definitely a cool card, because I am a die-hard Ichiro fan, as most of you probably know already. So we will set that right back there in front of Luis Robert. We won't be finding any of his cards today. Uh, play to earn a real jersey card. So that was something you could do uh, up until September 30th of 2009. So when that expired, you got a Dan Heron and a Carlos Lee. All right, let's do the series or uh, 2018 series one uh, retail. Now there are chances to find autographs and stuff in here. I don't know what the odds are for autographs. There's also uh, Mother's Day and Father's Day uh, short prints, I believe. Yeah, there's hot pink and powder blue. There's a Memorial Day camo cards, platinum, printing plates, base short prints. The base short print is one in every 45 packs. Super short print rookie variation is one in every 1,347 packs. Uh, let's see here. Rainbow foil is one in 10. Gold is one in 15. What's the autograph? Looks like autograph is one in 840 packs. So we'll see. Of course, that's the retail version. Hobby might be a little a little easier to pull an auto out of a hobby pack. Uh, there's Eduardo Nunes. Bruce Maxwell. Koji Urea. Or Urahara. Urahara, sorry. Uh, Jackson Stevens. Greg Allen, rookie. Justin Verlander. 80, was that 83 design? Yeah. There's Cam Gallagher. Milwaukee Brewers, whoops, as I just kind of fling that off to the side there. Uh, um, Edinson Volquez, Nick Ahmed, Byron Buxton, and Lonnie Chisenhall. And the Hobby Pack. Let's see real quick, autograph on these. Well, it looks like it's one in every 1,100 packs, unless I'm reading that wrong. That can't be right. Here, I'll, I'll just hold this up here. You guys can pause the video if you want. Take a look at that. Let's just get this finished up here. That seems a, that seems like it'd be a little high for a hobby pack, but maybe. Uh, Martin Maldonado. Christian Yelich. Potent pair, Miggy and Hose. A checklist card. A Clayton Kershaw, League Leaders. Wade Boggs, 83 design. There's a Brandon Finnegan. Cleveland Indians. Andrew Kashner. There's a Chelsea Cuthbert. Or Cuthbert. And Jose Batista. And our last pack before we look at our hit is, you know what, I'm going to do the hit, the hit card first. Again, there's the Babe Ruth collection. I'm not going to open that. I'm going to go out on a limb and say this hit card is probably, only because I've seen quite a few of them so far, it's probably a 2014 uh, red, white, and blue draft picks card. Hey, what do you know? Austin Casino. I'm not familiar with that name. 
Uh, it is cool design, um, but again, I'm not familiar with that name, so you guys will have to let me know. And let's get into this last pack here. Now, I opened a lot of the 2019 holiday. Um, unfortunately, it was before I started making videos. Oh, uh, man. It's kind of hard to see. There are super rare holiday variation short prints, things like that. Give you guys a second. I'm trying to get a good angle on here. If you want to pause the video, take a check or take a look. Um, like I said, it, unfortunately, as before I started making videos, I did open a ton of this product and I found, I think, if I remember correctly, I found absolutely zero autograph cards. Um, I did find a couple of relics, but I didn't find any autographs. This one's actually got a thick card in it, so it looks like we might have a relic in here. Uh, let's just move that. Oh, look. Scooted it right to Cheater Altuve. <laughs> Manny Machado. There's a Wilson Contreras. Javi Baez. Brandon Brennan. Clayton Kershaw. Jose Iglesias. And our hit. Again, believe it's a relic. Our hit is from the New York Mets. Is this Pete Alonzo? That would be awesome. No, it's not. It's Michael Conforto. Game used memorabilia card. So we did get a hit. Um, not uh, not the Met I was looking for, but that's okay. Michael Conforto is not horrible. I do see his uh, cards in quite a few products. Get it sleeved up real quick. So... Again, we got a hit, which is awesome. It's always nice to pull a hit out of a pack. Um, I'm super stoked about that. Again, not the uh, not the Met that I was looking for, but that's okay. I hope you guys enjoyed the video today. If you did, make sure you hit that subscribe button. Also, hit that thumbs up button below the video. Uh, that does help out quite a bit. And hit that notification bell so you get notified of when I post new videos. I try and do one every day. Um, lately, it's been uh, two a day if I, if I can get them both in there. Um, and we will catch you on the next video. Thanks everybody for watching. Have a great day.